Well, we're pretty certain our next guest will be on our screens for many, many years to come. At just 15 years old, Chloe Grace Moretz has already starred in an Oscar-winning movie and has won all sorts of awards. Her latest role brings her up uh, close and personal with Johnny Depp in Tim Burton's mm. version of Dark Shadows. Let's see them in action. From Firenze, Italia, each joint containing a single Are you stoned or something? They tried stoning me, my dear. It did not work. When did they start allowing women of the night on this dead ground? Chloe, I saw the movie yesterday. Uh, very good it was indeed. Uh, based on a, a very famous TV series. Uh, for those who aren't familiar with Dark Shadows, just give us a flavour of what it's about. Um, well, it was a daytime soap opera in America, and it's uh, actually one of the longest running soap operas in uh, American history. So it went on from about, I think, 65 to like 72. And of course gave you the opportunity to work uh, very closely alongside uh, Johnny Depp. I'm sure you're the envy of uh, many girls around the world. Uh, what's he like to work with? He's amazing. You know, he's one of the most humble guys you could ever work with. You know, you walk onto set and you try and imagine what Johnny Depp would be like. And then he just mm. greets you every morning, just kind of like, hey, how you doing? And it's like no big deal. You play a moody teenager. <laughs> I do. <laughs> Easily? <laughs> Easily. Um, for the sake of my mom seeing this, no. <laughs> no. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess, yeah, it's one of the roles that I could relate to the most because we're the same age and dealing with fairly the same things, except for with oh, her, she has great. a much That's darker so secret. Really yeah. And she also has, yeah. thanks to Tim Burton, a very cool I bedroom, uh, which I'd imagine is the envy of teenagers everywhere. What was it like when he showed you the, the, the bedroom where we first see you? Well, it was one of the first days on set, and he was like, do you want to go see your room? And I was like, yeah, of course, thinking it'll be like some cool kind of bungalow-y type thing. And I walk in, and it's this purple, psychedelic, 70s kind of hippie room with a shag carpet and, like, a hanging seat. And it's just, it was completely Tim Burtonized, you know, so you imagine already a psychedelic 70s. Well, we had uh, the UK premiere uh, of the film uh, last night, as you know, and Johnny Depp and uh, the director Tim Burton were particularly complimentary about you. You'll be delighted to hear. <laughs> Girl is amazing. She's a real, first of all, she's a real pro, um, but she's also, she's also uh, a very, very interesting actress. It's very rare to meet somebody who's got such a, a strong sense of themselves and what they want to do and do interesting things, and I love her. You You're are, a great accolade. I oh, know, wow. you are setting the bar, <laughs> Chloe, very high, because I mean, it was only very recently that you starred in Hugo, which had so many Oscar nominations and an Oscar win, and that was directed by Martin Scorsese and had a cast of fabulous British actors. Where do you go from here? <laughs> um, I'm just going to try and keep trucking, you know, keep taking a stab at it. I mean, I just, you know, I love what I do, and I've been so far so blessed to be able to work with such amazing directors and actors, and, you know, um, we'll see what the cards deal me. And it's very much a family affair, isn't it? I mean, tell us a little bit about your family background. As I understand, your mum was a nurse, uh, mm -hmm. your dad was a plastic surgeon, mm -hmm. and your brother is sitting over there, actually. Yeah. He's your advisor. <laughs> yep, yeah? yep. My brother is What's my... What's he do for you? He's my acting coach slash brother. So he's been working with me since he was 15, and I was five. And your family remained... I'm not on top of you in, the, in, in your career, but I, I mean, obviously, They're keeping a close eye on you. Yes, incredibly protective. My family is, is very involved in my career and very involved in my personal life, and we're thick as thieves, for sure. What do you do about... Oh, sorry. sorry. No, you carry on. I was going to say, how do, you, how do you actually sort of figure the, sc the schooling as well as the acting? I mean, how, how, how do you rock and roll the two of those? <laughs> well, I've been doing um, homeschool since I was in fourth grade, so since I was about, like, uh, nine and um, it's yeah it's great you know I go through Laurel Springs and I've had the same tutor for about eight years and then when I'm not working my mom tutors me and a lot of um, you spent a lot of the last two and a half years in, in Britain because <laughs> much of Hugo was shot here and Dark Shadows was shot in Britain too um, how do you like London and you know presumably London's become a bit of a home for you has it oh yeah I mean I was talking to my brother as we were driving in from Heathrow and just just driving in, it was completely nostalgic because I lived here for because so long. Because it was raining, you mean? <laughs> yeah, exactly. No, well, I was like, oh, it's just, it's so London, you know, you come in, it's raining, but then you have all the beautiful greenery, and it's just, oh, you know, when you drive through Hyde Park, it's just, it's one of the most amazing feelings London has. 
The crucial, uh, probably the most difficult question for you this morning is what was your favorite sweet? We've been asking people all morning about what, the, what their favorite sweet or drink was uh, as a child at school, what their, what their memories are. What, what was yours? It would have to be either Chupa Chups, Chup, Chupa Chups, Chupa Chups, Chupa Chups, <laughs> or Nutella, for sure. Oh, N Nutella. The, the chocolate spread. Chocolate yes. Spread. Oh, so good. Well, thank, lovely to meet you yeah, and all the very best nice uh, with your career, thank which is you. astonishing already. <laughs> so we're going to see a lot, lot more of you, Chloe. And thanks very, very much indeed for all your texts and emails.